Hello guys, uh, uh, welcome to Close Attention once again. Uh, now today we're going to quickly do this problem here, which is taken from some of the question papers, previous question papers, for QMI 1500. Okay, now let us quickly read out the question. Romelo bought a cell phone for 3000 rands. He also bought a time, costing 1% of the cell phone price. At the pay point, the cashier gave him a 20% discount on the total bill. What is the amount that he had to pay? What is the amount that he had uh, to pay? The amount that he had to pay? Okay, now let us first check, look at this. We have 3000 rands here and 1%. Now, this is the uh, cost of the cell phone. Now, the cost of the a time is 1%. Now we want to convert this 1% into the money which is in a range. Okay, so now we're going to calculate by multiplying um, 3000 rands and the 1%. You know that 1% is equal to 0 0.01. 1% is equal to 0 0.01. All right, now let us uh, quickly calculate we're gonna multiply 3000 by 0 0.01 now we can come and say uh, the cost of the cell phone which is uh, uh, 3000 rands oh sorry uh, the cost of the cell phone which is 3000 rands Okay, here we go, 3000 runs, multiply by, we are multiplying by, um, we are multiplying by the, by 1%, which is the price of the, of A time, 1% is equal to 0 0.01, 0 0.01, okay, that's correct. Now, all this is equal to the price of the A-time. All this is equal to price of A-time. How much is the price of A-time? Okay, now before we write the price, to limit the confusion, we can just come and say 3000 range is the price of the phone multiplied by A-time percent of the A-time, which is 1% of this. We get uh, the number here is... Uh, you can all open our calculators to verify if it is correct. I think it's uh, 30. Let us verify the 1% of 3000. Okay. You can do this on your calculator. Okay, the answer is 30, right? Now it's 30 rands. Now you have got your price here. Oh, what's this price for? This is the price of a time, right? Price of the a time because they said that uh, the he also bought a time costing one percent of the cell phone price. Now this is one percent of 30,000 rands, which is 30 rands. Now a time cost 30 rands. Okay, now. At the pay point, the cashier gave him a 20% discount on the total bill. Now, before we calculate the 20% discount, let us go to the total bill because the cost here, he bought two things. He bought the um, cell phone and also a time. Now, the total bill is the combination or is the addition of 3,000 runs of the cell phone and 30 runs, which is 1% of the total cost of the phone. Or there is the addition of cell phone and a time right a time cost 30 run cell phone cost uh, 30,000 rand. now the total uh, bill here that he was supposed to pay before he was given a uh, discount the total uh, is, uh, is equal to the cost of the cell phone and uh, Okay, the cost of the cell phone is 3,000 rands, okay? 3,000 rands 
the money is in rents. Okay, there's nothing has than uh, doing uh, finance mathematics, you're writing all this lot of amount of money while you're broke, you know. Now, the total, okay, let us continue. The total is uh, 3,000 rents plus the cost of a time. Cost of a time is um, steady rents, okay. Cost of a time is the difference. Now, here we go. I'm gonna be a bit slow because the device that I'm using is not working properly. Okay. Now, this is the total. The total that it was supposed to pay is the cost of the uh, cell phone plus a time, which is 3,030. Right. Now, this is equal to uh, 3,030. Let us write it here. It's gonna be equal to uh, 3030 rents okay it's a lot amount of money 3030 uh, rents uh, 3030 uh, rents okay now this is uh, the total that he was supposed to pay now let us finish up by um, writing the total cost that he paid the amount that he paid now this is the cost that he was supposed to pay now let us calculate the total that he paid after what after getting a 20 percent discount now they're saying that they at the pay point the cashier or the tail operator gave him a 20 percent discount on the total bill now this is the total bill now he's supposed to get a 20 percent discount here now what do we do we're gonna do like the first step here Calculating 20% of 3030. Okay, now because here we calculated, uh, we calculated um, 3000 rands, we calculated 1% of 3000 rands. Now we're going to calculate 20% of, we're going to calculate 20% of 3030. Okay, to calculate the 20% of 3030, we're going to come and multiply um we are calculating the percent that he got uh, the percent that he got we're gonna come and say uh, 3000 okay sorry it's gonna be uh, 3000 rents it's not 3000 rents guys uh, 3030 rents it's gonna be 3000 and 30 rents this is a simple it's a simplest problem this is a simple problem now it's 3030 multiply by now we are multiplying with the percent uh, that he got which is uh, which is um 20 percent now how much is 20 percent Oh, I remember 1% was uh, 0 0.01 Now we just have to go to your calculator and calculate the value of 20% 20% is 0 0.2 So now you're gonna come here and multiply uh, here by 0 0.2 which is 20% Now you're gonna we have to find the value of 20% here Now what we are doing here we are finding the value of 20% Okay, now 20% is equal to 0 0.2. You can verify this using your calculator. You can go to your calculator and write 20%, right? Or 100, uh, 20 divided by 100. Now it's uh, 0 0.2, 0 0.2, which is equal to which is equal to now we are calculating the value of 20% that he got the discount the value of the discount that he got now when you multiply let us go to the calculators and multiply um, 3030 or uh, 3030 is gonna be 3030 multiplied by 0 0.2 now the 20% they are talking about is uh, equal to the 20% they are talking about is equal to I'm sure you have got the answer with your calculator is 606 
okay the total discount that he got when he was buying this cell phone is 606 rands okay okay now the total is 606 rands okay the total discount that he got now to find uh, the amount here to find the amount that he had to pay is simple you just have to come to the total that he was supposed to pay here which is 3030 rands 3000 of the cell phone and the runs of the airtime now they say that he got a discount of 20 percent how much is 20 percent 20 percent is 606 so you just have to come and say the total that you were supposed to pay which is 3030 we subtract or we minus the discount of 606 and then we get uh, the amount the amount that we're going to get is going to be in here on option one two three or four okay now the total amount that he paid the amount uh you're gonna forgive me of my handwriting guys the device that i'm using is uh giving me trouble all right now let us write the amount the amount guys is equal to you see i'm even struggling to to write in a oh okay the amount that he paid now this is the amount that he paid the total amount okay we have calculated everything we've calculated the one percent of the airtime we've calculated the uh, the addition of the cell phone and airtime which is this one we've calculated the discount now we are going to use um the amount of 3030 and uh, the discount of 606 now we're gonna come and write we're gonna come and write um okay let's just, let us write the total that he was supposed to pay which is three thousand three thousand and thirty rands okay three thousand and uh, thirty rands okay now this three thousand and thirty rands is the amount that he was supposed to pay right now they say that he got a discount when he, someone get a discount they are minusing or subtracting from the original total that he was supposed to pay how much are we deducting from this total it is uh 606 which is 20 percent of three thousand and thirty rands okay now they are saying that he got a uh, discount now we deduct the discount of 606 okay we have deducted 606 rands which is um, the discount price now let us go to the total that he paid the total that he paid the total that he paid after discount now you can go to your calculator and write 3030 minus 606 now 3030 minus 606 is 2424 the total is 2000 is 2000 um excuse my handwriting guys but the answer is uh 2000 uh guys this device that i'm using yes thank you go it's 2424 okay 424 it's 2424 guys this the total uh that you paid this the total that he paid when he purchased the cell phone okay cell phone is three thousand rands uh then the airtime costs one percent one percent is equal to 30 rands okay because it's one percent of three thousand now why did we use 3030 because the price of the cell phone which is 3000 rands plus a time which is 30 rands now the discount we don't calculate it from the 3000 because the discount it is the discount of all a time and the cell phone together uh now we first combine this price of the cell phone and price of the a time to get the total amount that the guy is supposed to pay now to mellow 
Oh, uh, it was supposed to pay 3030 rents. Now they said that the discount, you got the discount um, on the total bill. Yeah, here, this is the keywords again total bill now this is the total bill because it's the combination of the addition of the cell phone and the airtime the total bill now they're saying that you got 20 percent discount on the total bill now the total bill we get the 20 percent we calculate 20 percent of the total bill which is the 5030 rents now the total um uh, bill here 20 percent of it 20 percent of this is 3030 multiplied by 0 0.2 0 0.2 is 20 percent right now we get 606 this is the 20 percent that you got discount now the 20 percent now when we have got now the discount here we have got the discount and the total bill that you were supposed to pay obviously the discount we are deducting then we deduct uh, 606 which is the discount from 3030 that is what we did here. Um, 3030 is the total bill minus 606, which is 20%. Now we got a total of 2424, which is, means that the option which is correct here, 2424, it is our option number three. This is correct. Thank you guys for watching. Those who need assistance with assignments can text us on our WhatsApp page. To get our WhatsApp page, you need to be following us on our Facebook page. Then you get the number on bio. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you for watching. And please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.